Hi, welcome back to another Crypto Dave video. Now today I'm going to do a very quick Golem Network Provider update video. This is number three. I've done two uh, update videos previously, number one and two, and this is the third one in the series. This will be the last one, but I just wanted to make people aware of the changes that have been going on with Golem when you're running as a provider on the network, and also to talk a little bit more about some of the uh, payment issues which were occurring before and how they've been addressed with the latest versions of the software so this was the figures from the first update video so you can see here from the 12th of april which is when i first started running as a provider uh, to the 24th of june so over those first sort of three months uh, we received 280 jobs uh, 63 have been confirmed and 217 were still awaiting um, so only 23 percent of jobs had confirmed and only 10 percent of the GNT that we should have earned. Uh, GNT is a Golem Network token. That's the uh, that's the coin that you earn for running as a provider. Only 10% of the GNT we should have earned uh, was actually received. And that changed a little bit by the second update a few months later, but we were still seeing a sort of a broadly similar pattern. So we we're up to 27% of jobs had been paid and 17% of the GNT earned had been uh, paid out and the rest of it was still awaiting and we had this big issue within the network of awaiting payments often they went on for months and months and <clears throat> excuse me the team always uh, said basically you had to wait 30 days and then people would wait 30 days nothing would kind of change and a lot of these kind of jobs went back months and months and months back to sort of April and May uh, so anyway we were in a similar kind of position where a lot of the jobs or most of the jobs that we were uh, completing successfully according to the software wasn't being paid out now we've had a massive change uh, since the 18th of October so a few days after that the uh, latest version at the time which was version 0.18.1 came out and suddenly we started not just getting paid very quickly for new jobs on the network but also uh, getting paid for backdated jobs and since then we've moved on to version 0.18.2 which is the latest version but over the last uh, sort of month or so basically Pretty much all of the awaiting jobs from before have now been paid out. So if we have a look at this, this is a really healthy looking uh, graphs now. So of the 806 jobs between the 12th of April and 16th of December uh, were 369.02 GNT. 775 jobs have now confirmed. 31 jobs are still awaiting. So it's 4% of jobs are still awaiting. A tiny amount now, you know, there can always be issues with a kind of few jobs. I think if the software had started with this anywhere, you know, maybe even up to 10, 20 percent of jobs uh, sort of like outstanding, I think people would not have had an issue at all. But um, the really good news is 96 percent of jobs have now been paid. 97 percent of GNT earn has been received. So I'm happy to say I can really recommend uh, running as a network provider on the Gollum network. Um, you're not going to make a huge amount of money. I generally get maybe one, occasionally two jobs a day. What seems to be the case, and it, it still seems to be the case with the latest versions of the software, uh, when you, if you need to reboot your machine or something like that and you open up the software again, it often gets jobs pretty much immediately within the first few hours of starting it up. And then often it can kind of wait for a while. Now, I think the team have confirmed that there isn't any kind of intentional kind of bias to potentially new users or rebooting your kind of um, your uh, application but there was a time when i was getting like loads of windows updates that required um uh, rebooting the machine it's running on a windows machine my uh, golem uh, software and every time it rebooted or needed a reboot i was getting new jobs so it did seem to be the case and apparently it is still the kind of case so if you uh, have been running for a kind of while you're not receiving any jobs anything like that um, might be worth shutting down the software rebooting your machine and opening it up again um, because that can sometimes can trigger new jobs uh, to be available for you but um yeah the good news is everything's improved massively compared to this was the first set of figures so over 75 percent uh, still awaiting then just over 75% or just under 75% awaiting and now to basically just 4% which is uh, neg negligible even so um, yeah really good uh, news with the latest updates uh, the team are doing a, a, a great job there uh, it will be great to have some more jobs on the system it's still only being used for uh, blender rendering um, but hopefully this um, next year if you're looking at the 
um, like the roadmap and stuff like that, there will be additional use cases coming out. Um, the other thing that would be nice is if we at some point can have GPU support on the Windows version. I know GPUs are NVIDIA GPUs rather are now supported on the Linux uh, version of the software, but not on Windows or Mac. So that would be not. I don't think it's Mac, certainly not on Windows. Um, so it'd be nice to see that maybe implemented at some point in 2019. But yeah, um, I think, you know, the software kind of works quite well. I think from an end user point of view, so from a requester point of view, I believe it works pretty well that the, the jobs are getting kind of uh, completed uh, for quite a good value a rate compared to kind of market rates from some of these large render farms. So that all seems good. So uh, really time now, I think, to start... Um, hopefully kind of branching out into other use cases, you know, artificial intelligence, uh, machine learning, stuff like that. So we're looking forward to seeing what Gollum will come up with in 2019. But yeah, as I mentioned, just a very quick update video today to say that um, if you had watched any of the previous update videos and you were worried about, you know, doing kind of work and not getting paid out, um, that's no longer the case. And even better, a lot of the jobs that were seemingly stuck in the queue and I never thought would get paid out have now been paid out so anyway thanks very much for watching ask me any questions uh, below i'll put all the links to the previous videos and the golem web website i did um, a setup video a while ago about how to get going as a network provider i'll put all those links below uh, but if you have any questions ask me in the comments below have a great day and hopefully i will see you on the next video bye bye